Credit card hackers have been making headlines, stealing info from millions of shoppers at stores like Target and Michaels. Yeah, but we found out there's a bunch of thieves who can hack your card just by walking by you. Mike Holfold joins us now. And Mike, this really sounds like science fiction, but you saw it firsthand. Uh, this is the real deal. No science fiction. Hi, everyone. We're talking about smart chips. There are 200 million of these cards in circulation right now. Thieves don't need to be close, folks. 25 feet away and your credit or debit card is theirs. How do they do it? Watch. The people sitting in this local mall food court don't know it, but their credit card numbers are actually being scanned, stored, and stolen while they eat. How many cards are we talking about? Hold that thought. Well, I have my card. How is this possible? Well, did you know your card was chipped? Chris Gilpin, a senior consultant with National Crime Stop, says the radio frequency chip in your credit card is the secret. It allows you to pay with a wave, just inches in front of the store's scanner. But think about it. What if someone bought a scanner and boosted that signal? They can boost the signal strength from two or three inches to over 25 feet for $8. That's what Chris did, slipping through this lunchtime crowd with the enhanced scanner in a satchel. And I didn't talk to anyone. I was just simply walking through the crowd, which is what these criminals do. They call it pocket surfing, wireless theft, RFID pickpocketing. In less than two minutes, Chris pocket surfed his way to 19 credit card numbers. Now, we made sure only the last four digits were visible. The thieves get the whole thing, including codes and PIN numbers and the victims never know it. And they're just walking down the street basically with their name, number, expiration date on their shirt as far as the hacker's concerned. Gilpin, a UCF computer science grad, had tested that theory before. Last fall, he documented a one-man hit in downtown Orlando. In 45 minutes flat, he walked away with 63 credit card numbers. 63 numbers in 45 minutes, that is, I mean, I think it should shock anyone who's not in the industry, who maybe is even unaware that this is even possible. So think about it. That means everybody sitting in this restaurant could have their credit card or debit card maxed out. They wouldn't know how, and they wouldn't know when. The Signal Vault is like a bulletproof vest for your wallet. Gilpin says he has a solution. He calls it the Signal Vault. He says it'll block the pickpocket scanner. Well, we brought him into the studio to prove it. Watch. First, the unprotected credit card. Then, a card protected by Signal Vault. It powers up and it creates what we've called an e-field around this card, which will protect as many chip cards you have near this little Signal Vault. It will protect them all, making them invisible to hackers. Now, a lot of you watching right now may have those magnetic strips. But by October of 2015, most retailers and banks will be using smart chip technology because, according to Visa, it catches counterfeit cards at the point of purchase. Security experts say then, more cards, more thefts. And that's why we're doing the story tonight. Fascinating, scary stuff. Now, I want to know, if you buy that card, first off, how much does it cost? And right. is there anything else out there you could use? We've been doing this story for years now. We have seen various options, small aluminum wallets, aluminum sheets you can wrap around the cards. But this card, this card has a patent pending. As for the cost, just under 15 bucks. Not a bad investment. No, not, not a bad, bad at, at all. all. Yeah. Thanks, Mike.